which say that there is no resurrection and asked him saying master Moses said if a man die having no children his brother shall marry his wife and raise up seed unto his brother now there were with all seven brethren and the first when he had married a wife diseased and having no issue left his wife unto his brother likewise the second also and the third unto the seventh and last of all, the woman died also. Therefore, in resurrection, whose wife shall she be of the seven? For they all had her. Father, thank you for your word. Speak to us through your word this morning and take back your glory in Jesus' name. God bless you. You may please take your seat. This morning I want to preach a message I tied to dealing with the cause from the bloodline by the blood of Jesus. Say after me, dealing with the cause from the bloodline by the blood of Jesus. Dealing with the cause or dealing or dealing with the cause or dealing with the causes from the bloodline by the blood of Jesus. Now, what is cause? It simply means an appeal to a demonic forces and supernatural forces to harm a person or thing or make a life miserable. A cause simply means an appeal to a demonic forces or supernatural forces to harm a person or a thing and make the life of that person miserable. It is an embargo place to afflict somebody through spoken words, through the blood pattern, or through demonic forces. I repeat, it is an embargo place to afflict someone through spoken words, through blood pattern, or through a demonic forces. I've said this before now and I want to repeat it again. Child of God. Whenever God wants to bless a man, he will send an angel in form of human being. And whenever the devil wants to place a cause or want to afflict someone, he will equally send a demon in form of human being. And this thing always come by spoken word. And that's why you see those from occultics, those from the demonic world. You see them whenever they want to afflict somebody. They may carry ordinary broom, carry something and put together and speak into that and say, so, so person and so, so person, you have become this. And they will invoke a demon and send a demon on assignment to afflict a destiny. I don't know the cause or causes that have been placed upon your destiny. Be it from your father's house or your mother's house. That cause shall be destroyed this morning. That cause shall be destroyed this morning. That causes shall be destroyed this morning. 
the louder your amen, the faster the testimony. Now, sit down. In that portion of the scripture, in that Matthew chapter 22, reading verse 23 to 28, talking about the story of a family. In that family, they have seven boys, or permit me to say seven men. And the first son from the seven married to a woman. The woman did not have any issue. The man died. Immediate younger brother stepped into the same shoe without having any issue. He died. Nobody learned lesson. The third one to say, I never see any girl for town. But still, my brother wife stepped into the same shoe. Ah. Nothing to show again. That one died. That is a cause from the blood pattern. That is a cause from the bloodline. There are some family under the sound of my voice that in their own family, once they get to the verge of breakthrough, they die. As it comes. There are some in their family, they will rise to the peak of glory and they will bring them to the level of disgrace. There are some in their family, violence is the order of the day. There are some in their family, if they laugh today, they cry tomorrow. I don't know the cause or causes. But I've been fighting your destiny. But I came by the blood of the one who died and rose on the third day. And I correct that foundation in the name of Jesus. I rebuild that foundation in the name of Jesus. I rebuild that foundation in the name of Jesus. I rebuild that foundation in the name of Jesus. I rebuild that foundation in the name of Jesus. The third one step, sit down, step into the same shoe. And after a while, without having any child to, he died. Number four did not learn lesson. Ah, because some family can be very funny. But you will not blame them. It's because of the cause from the bloodline. The fifth one carried the same shoe oversized. Where again? After the wife, he died. Number six, he not learn lessons. Say, okay, woman, my number five brother don't die. Okay, step into the shoe. <laughs> At least if something has happened the first time, the second time, the third time, I expected somebody to learn lessons. And that's why you must change the pattern from your bloodline this morning. Because you know why? If you don't change it, nothing will change for you. Somebody's not getting what I'm saying. Say, well, God understand. I know that one day my story will change. It's Eliza. The change starts from you. You are the one that will stand your ground and say, I am tired. This thing cannot repeat itself again. Enough of delay. Like a woman came to me for counseling. She had been married for more than 11 years. I hope now she's not barren. But the moment she gets pregnant, after two months or three months, something like a shock will just come and say, Hey! And she will see good. That's a cause from the bloodline. The last one that now happened that I make her, ah, somebody now told her about this church, that make her rush to me for counseling. They went to the village and brought somebody to come and be staying with them. He said, this child has been so wonderful and very nice. This woman became pregnant again. He said, all of a sudden, the boy just climbed the table in the house. I was playing on the table, was playing, playing, playing. Then the woman rushed out of the kitchen and saw the boy playing on the table. He said, ah, this boy will not kill me for her to rush blood again. When she came, we wanted to talk. I said, don't see anything. Let us pray. After the prayer, God began to open my eyes. Sit down. And I began to tell her some things. She now said, sir, don't go too far. Allow me to explain. I said, for how many years? All the minute. By now, you are supposed to have half. If he's having every two, two years, at least by now, he's supposed to have seven children. He said, my own is not that I know they get pregnant and they carry belly. But the thing we just throw something like a shock. Hey! Even if she's inside the church now and maybe somebody talks to her, hey! They nest in her blood. I 
I said, this is a cause from the bloodline. This is a cause from the blood pattern. When God opened my eyes and I asked her a question, where is your mother? She said, my mother is late. What happened to your mother? He said, well, my mother was sick and she died. I said, do you remember when your mother wanted to die? She asked you that she come and put her a hand pit like this. He said, yes, but my father did not allow me. I said, your mother knows this because what is happening in your family is that every first female child must have miscarried. Until when your biological mother put your hand under her like this. So at least they happen. Your biological mother will carry hand and put like this and use it to pray for you. So when the woman was to die, she now remember, I have not done my daughter's own. When she now wanted to pray, the husband does the bond. Don't mind your mother, leave her. You know that kind of thing. She was helpless and the woman died. And the daughter too did not know why the woman said, come on, put your hand until God revealed it by prophecy. Now, for the sin she has never committed, 14 years she suffered for it. For the sin she has never committed. Ah! Break out to Falida Zataka. There are some family Their own pattern is untimely death For instance Those that went for aptitude test They said seven died in Abuja But I know they are more than that They will never give us the right figure And I asked myself one question That if immigration cannot control the people that comes for interview. What gives you assurance that they can control border? No, it's, it's a, like one of my old man in the village used to say, single arithmetic. Single arithmetic meaning simple arithmetic. So single arithmetic. Very simple. If you cannot control Sir, this nation is rich to the teeth. Take it or you leave it. I can't imagine migration asking these boys and girls to pay one one thousand for attitude test again. Does it mean the federal government cannot handle these are young men and women that they are still striving hard? Graduates and the ones that don't even go to school. They just want to find their feet in life. One came to me, he said a particular immigration man collected 250 from him. And I said, what gives you assurance? I said, you could get the job. I said, but that man that collected that money from you will suffer. You capitalize on somebody's problem. I met a Lebanese in Kutonu where they sell cars. And while we are talking, I say, all these cars are too much. Why are the people buying? He says, sir, now your people from Nigeria. I say, are you sure? He said, in a day, minimum of four to five hundred cars leave this town to Nigeria. In a day, every day. He says, sir, Nigeria has money. That was what the Lebanese guy told me. He said, Nigeria has money. He said, any day Nigeria does not come to Kutorun to buy, they are in soup. But yet, they have refused to allow the thing to circulate to yourself. Whether you believe it or not, we are operating under a curse. I'm talking about the bloodline, and you know why? Innocent blood are crying every day. These guys, they kill, they bury, they slaughter innocent people just to fortify themselves and to retain their office so that they can continue in their stealing. You are fighting harm robbers. What about pain robbers? They said they caught somebody for so so and so so. They jailed him. 
they call somebody for so and so they jail her jailing should start from the president jailing should start from the governors jailing should start from the senators how much is their salary are they living within their salary or yet if they catch anybody on this road now with phone, they are ready to stone the person to death. Our nation is oppressing under the curse. And we need the blood of Yeshua to change the blood pattern. It's a pity that men who are supposed to do the fight, they have ate on the table of Jezebel. It's a pity that fathers who are supposed to stand in the gap, they are eating on the table of Jezebel. If you focus on a brown envelope, you can't develop. Oh, I just said I should come and know how you are doing. How is everything? Don't worry, it is well with you because of envelope. And deep down in you, you know it is not well. And when you collect the envelope, you want to pray. You are expecting God to hear. God cannot hear that kind of prayer. Second Chronicles 7 14. If my people, which are called by my name, shall humble themselves and seek my face and turn away from their wicked ways, then will I hear from heaven and hear their life. These days now, what we use to qualify a man of God is the number of cars, the number of suits, the number of houses, and the exotic cars and the escort how do you expect god to change the pattern of this nation when the priest that's supposed to stand in the gap is using mopo as an escort mopo that is carrying a rifle with odeshi odeshi is guiding a man that is dwelling in the secret place of the most high So how do you expect God to answer? We have already saw our hand on the table of Jezebel. The generals of old, they walk alone because their hands are clean. The generals of old, I don't think they even know anything about tinted glass. Today, pastors must go on tinted glass. Because why? Once God takes us to that level, you cannot relate with the poor again. Shoe don't get size. Then if you get size, how can our nation be put in size? The blood pattern. The blood pattern. The blood pattern. I don't know the one that has been affecting your destiny. I don't know the one that has been affecting your life. I don't know the one that has been affecting you. But I came to declare upon you in the name of Yeshua Amashiach, the one who died and rose on the third day. That blood pattern shall be corrected. That blood pattern shall be corrected. That blood line shall be corrected. That blood line shall be corrected. If you believe, let me hear them like a winner. to minister in a church in Lagos and I took a cab straight from airport to the church and why the man of God came and welcomed me he said where are your entourage I said entourage I came in I said my bag is inside the uh, this chair it's inside the cab he said they want to take me to a hotel I said no 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 take my bag keep somewhere in your car when I finish from the church take me to the hotel that was the day we went to minister in New York. We left Calabar and there was satanic odor of at Odupani. I left that Odupani 1 a.m. We, we got to Uyo. I dropped the car and I climbed altar. I am a servant leader. They said they want to take me to hotel. I said, hotel. I came to work. Somebody's not getting what I'm saying. I came to work. Because by the time you take me to a hotel, when I enjoy the AC and feel the atmosphere, ah, flesh will always disagree with the things of the spirit. The anointing to preach may not be there again. It's not the one that say puts me in a, 
I didn't call it first class hotel. Pay two million to my account up front. Because now, honorarium is the order of the day. I told you about one, one ghost pet artist that we're supposed to invite. And I said, okay, I will come. You will pay one million up front. I said, don't worry, I will do the same, the anointing will flow. One million. To come and say, are you coming with your band? No, I'm coming alone on my CD. To play CD for me, one million. Not yet it. To come and play CD in the church. There's somebody who will not be shouting, hey, 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 because what? He's a celebrity. Oh, mom, I will do the singing after 15 minutes, I will prophesy. And the name of God will be glorified. I was not saying that money is much. You say, well, 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 that's what I collect. If you don't, that is what you collect. Because what? that one is not gospel artist. That one is business artist. Oh, which kind of gospel artist? Ghost, sir, he should use his uh, gift to serve God. Then let us appreciate her uh, at all. Their, their problem is that you believe you don't do it the way of the world. You can't get the blessing. It's a lie. If you do it faithfully, God will raise men to bless you. He will raise men to bless you. You don't need to cajole anybody. Now the question is this. All the millions, all the billions, by the time you acquire and put everything together, you will still die one day. Then if you die, what is going to happen to the money? And I've said this time with that number, I'm repeating it again. Oh boy, if you miss heaven, you can't miss hell. It's not possible. As I'm talking to you today, I will leave this world one day and I'm going somewhere. Are you sure of where you are going to? If you miss heaven, you can't miss hell. Then why not live a life that will glorify God? Why not live in what? Why the madness of money? We say we are not worshipping devil, we are worshipping God. But yet, 99% are worshipping devil. They are worshipping the spirit of money. They are worshipping the spirit of their cars. They are worshipping the spirit of their houses. Blood pattern. The number fifth did not learn its lesson. He stepped into the same shoe. After a while, he died. The sixth one did not learn his lesson. He stepped into the same shoe. After a while, he died. The last one to do the same thing and die. And at the end of it all, the woman finally died. If you are not ready for change, nothing is going to change in your life. But I came to declare for as many of you that desire change today, let the story of your life turn around for good. Let the story of your life turn around for good. Sit down. I've said this story here before and I want to repeat the story again. One man came and he said, Ha, ah, there is a place in Delta. There is an elderly woman in Delta. If they take you to the elderly woman, he has a long breast. They will throw the breast at the back like this. You will not see her face. You will stalk the breast from the back and sleep with her. He said, if you release one, 10,000 member. I said, what if I go to? He said, you will not have the strength to go to, but if you can go to 20,000 member. I said, oh boy, you'll be foolish, man. He said, how do you mean? As a drop of sperm contains 500 million cells. Then if I sleep with her, she gave me 10,000 member. From 500 million cells, minus 10,000. Who is gaining? Who is losing? And we see that you are foolish. Devil is not a creator. Devil is a duplicator. He only removes from what God has given to. So what they are still using to give you your member is still your destiny. And you will not need to be coming for fortification. You will need to be coming for sacrifice. So that the thing can continue to flow. Nonsense. Then you not expect such person to command demon to go out. You expect, listen to me. Man of God, why are you talking like this? Are you looking for a perfect man? No, I'm not looking for a perfect man. Are you looking for a perfect woman? No, I'm not looking for a perfect woman. Leave your normal, be practical. Eh? If you be agbero, show to us that you are an agbero so that we can know how to relate with you. Somebody's not getting what I'm saying. 
if you are a criminal show to us that you are a criminal so that we know how to relate with you if you are a prostitute show to us that you are a prostitute not to hide under the canopy of serving God and you are committing somebody is not getting what I'm saying are you sure you are getting what I'm saying and because of that even the so bony or cultic guys now you hardly see them in churches like this even fathers now somebody want to father you in ministry if you don't have good cash your tithe is not heavy your offering is not thick your seed is not carrying weight like Malu that has punch back you are not a good son and you are now saying we will continue to have criminal preachers new era preachers with heroes on the altars new era preachers with heroes or heroes on the altars why the father that was supposed to be there to correct the boys they are not there because they have set a standard and for you to meet up with that standard these guys too will have to go and two hand in something somebody is not getting what i'm saying but let a criminal come now make money and stand on the altar and preach look for any of the fathers give five million you don't be good son they will stamp you oh i preached for one of my son in abuja i was at time administration he gave me an oil of five million nonsense we are worshiping the god of what mammon and yet we are expecting god to change the bloodline have you not seen why we have prayed in this nation? We have prayed in this land, and yet it looks as if nothing is working. Where are fathers like late Archbishop Benson in Dauza? Where are fathers who are concerned about the growth of children and not what they want to collect from children, not how to exploit children? not how to tell a child that i'm raising this offering for the church and the moment they finish meeting they will tell you count the money and put inside my boot how many person will look up and talk to say father don't collect money then you are not expecting god to answer if my people which are called by my name shall humble themselves a lot of arrogant father who are not ready to humble themselves that man carry what I call planet influence. Planet influence. He mounted the podium in the last 45 minutes and he looked at all the archbishop and all the small bishop and all the mega bishop and says, All my fathers, and they sat down to collect father. Sir is not in title, is it's not in color, is in calling, it's not in title. You think he's carrying the long cap like Pope? But the man is there with his normal safari and everything, French shoes, and he's making planet influence for God, not for man. He still tell them, all oh, my fathers, but you and I know that who should be father? Is he the one with the long cap? If not be Panado, he can never be like Panado. You think he's in the Archbishop? Archbishop. In fact, there is another one that is reigning now. They call it say Mega Bishop. Mega. Mega. Very soon we'll be hearing Fire Bishop. Orishi Rishi. What kind of madness? Then how do you expect God to change the blood pattern of our nation? Because God will not come down. The people he has raised to change the blood pattern have gone astray. Everything now is not centered to money.